Hello guys and welcome back to another Creepycraft Gaming video. Today I'm here in my awesome YouTube Creative World. So basically I'm going to be doing a series of tutorials of how to build stuff, uh, of how to um, uh, how to do stuff like activate beacons, which is actually what we're doing in this episode. So you get these people who build massive, uh, well as you can see I've been experimenting a bit. You get these people who build massive houses, awesome houses, with so many details and they just want some decoration and they slap a beacon down in the middle of nowhere they try and activate it and they're like it doesn't work that's because you need to use a pyramid beacons don't work without a pyramid <coughs> sorry <coughs> so basically what you want to do to start off building a pyramid so your beacon can activate is you want to build a 5x5 five five square so you want to count along 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 one, two, three, four. Then you want to just fill this in because we know it's a five by five square. <coughs> As you can see, here we have our five by five square, which will soon turn out like that. <coughs> what you want to do is put a block here and put a block on top and break the block below. Then you want to cover that hollow bit in the side, inside up. So there's still <coughs> air. Next, what you want to do is place your beacon block in the middle. Now, as you can see, this will activate. Wonderful. Blimey, the moon's beautiful today. So what you want to do is, uh, there's no point having a beacon which doesn't give you a power up. Let's just see when it, what happens when I run past. It doesn't give me a power up. That's because you need to activate, like, you've activated the beacon, you've, you've made it shine, now what you need to do um, is feed the beacon. Uh, you may see on servers that the beacons don't have pyramids beneath. I think that's a plugin that the servers might be able to get, uh, but I'm not sure. But anyway, what you want to do is there are four items here, four minerals. So what you want to do is you want to get those four in your inventory or one of them, and you want to select a power up. So in this case, I'm selecting speed because I'm not a big fan of haste. So you want to drag one, and only one, because it will eat up all your resources, one of these minerals into this slot here on the menu, and you want to place it there, and you want to click done. So now what you'll notice is when you walk through the beacon, you'll get a speed effect, which lasts for, uh, I think it lasts forever, yeah. So that's a really good perk for survival. Um, Guys, please, if you enjoyed the commentary and you liked the video, please do a favourite, a subscribe, or um, even a like. Uh, it's much appreciated so the channel can grow bigger and I can put some more content out there. But, uh, as always, guys, I'll see you in the next video.